Every year, uh, as as a, as the head coach, you know my concern is for the safety of the players. And so, uh, you know, when people started wearing different um, things on top of their helmet to protect uh, from concussions, you know, we've had multiple conversations uh, with the with the medical staff, uh, with the doctors, with. Uh, everybody, athletic director, everybody involved to figure out what's the best way uh, that we can protect our players. And so obviously when pro caps came about, uh, the, the, the research was there, the data was there to back it up. Um, and I've been very uh, pleased with the results. I think uh, it's kept our guys healthy. Uh, we've had some, some, some tremendous impacts uh, and guys get right back up and go back to the huddle. So for us, uh, player safety is always first and foremost in our thought process. And I'm glad the medical uh, staff and the doctors was able to accommodate that. For us, we wanted to make sure that we had a good product that was going to do a good job for our student athletes. Uh, what there was out there for a long time, we weren't convinced was going to be the option for us. And when Safer uh, Protex came out, we got pretty excited about them. And a lot of that came from the data and the research that we were seeing that was, that was done um, to get this done. Well, at Virginia Tech, Dr. Duma, who has done all of the helmet ratings, uh, they got involved with this company and they've done it for all the other companies as well. And they studied it and they looked at the, the impacts that were taken to the head from a helmet standpoint and with the helmet covers on them. And so what they saw is they saw a much better reduction of the forces that were coming through the head. Um, and so that is what led us down this road. And so uh, once we saw that data and that research that came out, that's when we reassessed the situation and said, this is the product that we're going to need to use. Okay, so these are the ProTec caps that we're putting on uh, our student athletes. All they do is they slide down onto the helmet. There's four hooks that hook into place. And we have special pliers that are made for them. You just pull them down. They hook onto the plastic shell in four different locations to hold them on snugly uh, and to protect our guys as best we can. They are spring loaded, so it's a shell kind of over a shell. And so what happens is when a hit gets taken, not only is there or a distribution of force there, you're also getting some of that distribution from the springs inside as well. And what we've seen is they're not popping off, they're staying where they need to stay, and we're seeing a reduction in the overall force, which is what it's all about. You know, you look at the other guy across from you, you know, they have a, looks like they have a big head, you know, if the helmet, right? But no, you don't know, so it's super lightweight, and uh, you know, the statistics say that they prevent, you know, concussions and, you know, head injuries. So, you know, it's a great opportunity that we have them for this fall camp. It's great to be on the forefront of something brand new and something that's still, uh, still on the up and coming. And I think that really we can really boost it and have more people in the state be using it because we started it. I play center offensive line, so I'm hitting heads every single play, you know, unintentionally, but it happens, right? So, you know, the more protection we can have, you know, to keep, you know, myself and everyone else on the team safe is huge going into season. I think you're always looking at how do you make this thing safer, right? Uh, you know, the coaches and us, we've had this collaborative effort, which I've really appreciated. Even the snack break that you see, that wasn't a thing that was there. That's a break in the middle of the practice where everybody gets, you know, five, six minutes to get some water, get a snack in them. One of the best things about this process has been the collaboration. So we've had these discussions over time, and I think there's been no area that has, you know, superseded or just jumped the shark on this. So, you know, the coaches, us, equipment, even our strength staff and, and our operations, this has been a collaborative effort to get these helmet covers here. And I think that says a lot about NIU. Uh, it says that we want the best for our student athletes. And so I think that's something we can all appreciate.